The World Corporate Golf Challenge is a global event that sees teams of two from over 30 different countries compete in national tournaments to qualify for a place in the annual World Finals. Held in the picturesque Portuguese region of Cascais. For me, it's the best corporate tournament in the world. We are hosting this event for the past six years. Um, it's amazing for us to have these teams from, from all over the world playing in Cascais. I believe it's a perfect match, Cascais and the World Corporate Golf Challenge. Located just a short drive from the Portuguese capital, Lisbon, Cascais is a traditional and charming fishing town with an interesting and rich heritage that has developed into a premier resort destination. We are known as a land of kings and fishermen. All the court, all the nobles uh, came to Cascais and Cascais started to explode. Everything was ex flourishing and uh, it was vibrant. Cascais, I think it has a, has, a, has a blend of things that make this place unique. Uh, the landscape of Cascais is, is absolutely stunning. Not only Cascais, but the surroundings of Sintra, the mountains, the beaches, the, um, the gastronomy. So it's a perfect destination. In Cascais, you have serenity, tranquility, and an excellent quality of life. Well, look at it. It's, it's a beautiful destination. You know, lovely golf courses. Um, you know, lovely, lovely town, beach resorts. But the main thing are the people, and the people so far have been have been really nice. The natural scenery and pleasant year-round climate in Cascais make for a golfing hotspot. Oitevos Dunes is Portugal's top-ranked course and has played host to the World Corporate Golf Challenge for the last six years. Set against the stunning coastline of Serra de Sintra, the Lynx course offers a stern test for all handicaps and has earned worldwide acclaim. This golf course is situated in a location that is very unique in terms of what you could have. We are surrounded by the ocean. Although we are in a hilly place, so you have this feeling of depth over the, the Atlantic Ocean from every hole, which is very unique. You do not get tired of playing this golf course, because although it's a link style, it does have some holes which are a little bit of parkland style. You have to play all the different shots here, and, and you know, it's on some holes it's really wide open, and you've got a chance to open your shoulders, and on others you have to be a bit more canny. Uh, but the slopes uh, and, the, uh, and the firmness of the turf uh, and the general design of it make it a really good place to play. Held over three days, the World Finals attract many people to the beautiful region of Qashqais, who immerse themselves in the full programme of events, both on and off the course. It's about socialised people during a week now, so we, we have cocktails, we have uh, uh, drinks and food tastings, we have obviously golf, we have a gala dinner with a, a, a live music on the gala dinner, so we create throughout the week as many chances possible for people to get together, to enjoy. I think to spend a, what, what for many of them is an experience of a lifetime. The last day of action saw the Portuguese duo Carlos Tinoco and Luis Rodriguez take a narrow lead over the United Arab Emirates team. A hard-fought battle ensued throughout the day, but in the end it was the Portuguese natives who triumphed on the last hole to clinch the title. It's a very difficult day, but uh, in the final uh, we win. It okay. feels good okay. to win uh, yeah. in our country. All the winners took to the stage at the event-ending Black Tie Gala at the town's famous Casino Estoril, celebrating yet another remarkable year in Cascais.